It's summer, ladies, where the living is easy and it's time to head on vacation. If you're headed to the beach anytime this summer, then you don't want to miss this video because I'm sharing what to pack to the beach. It's all coming up next in style at a certain age. Hi ladies, it's Beth. Thanks so much for stopping by today. And if this is your very first time visiting, a very warm welcome. Hit the subscription box down below and the notification bell so you don't miss any videos coming your way. This channel is dedicated to aging with grace, strength, and beauty. So like, share, and comment so the YouTube algorithm is happy and more people just like you who want to stay modern, fresh, and relevant will discover this channel. Since style at a certain age is dedicated to aging with grace, strength, and beauty, I thought we would focus on strength today, and that's exercise. And I'm happy to partner with e-bike company 630 and show you this amazing e-bike that makes it very, very easy to exercise. And I love biking, but have you ever gotten on a bike and perhaps traveled too far and you didn't think that you had the power to get back? Well. 630 makes that problem extinct because you can use the, their motorized version or you can use just the regular gears and you can switch in and out seamlessly. It arrives straight to your door. You can assemble it yourself or if you want to have someone hire the assembly, you can work with 630 and they, they can arrange that too. So I just wanted to go through a few features and then take it for a spin ride. So come along and join me. Okay, today is all about a beach vacation. And as a matter of fact, I was just in Tybee, Tybee Island, Georgia, and that is on the Atlantic coast. And we have a beach home there. And I was lucky enough to go two weeks ago for a week long beach vacation. And I am telling you, I so needed it. And I'm just sharing what I packed and what you can pack for a one week, seven day beach vacation. And you can modify this. You can be a packer that likes to put everything in a carry-all and tra you know travel light, or you can be more like me where I have a suitcase and I pack it to the brim. So you can alter these numbers a little bit to suit your personal taste, but you really do want to have these items. It'll just make your life very easy if you start off with some t-shirts. And I love t-shirts and you can pick out the style that is best for you. V-neck is most universally flattering, but I also like the crew neck and the tank top and, um, and I like graphic tees too. So this is a cute little number from Anthropology, and they have adorable graphic tees and blouses too. I'm a big fan of Anthropology. So don't forget to put a graphic tee. They look darling with shorts, which I'll talk about. Or if you even have, you know, a really cute like chambray pants, anything that's, you know, out of the ordinary, this will just perk up in a, in a gif. And of course, white, you know, the neutrals are always easy. And a little tank top like this goes great with denim shorts. And then you can put on a linen shirt over the top of it. If you're going out to a restaurant, 
So don't forget a white tank top and then black, you know, there again, the neutrals. So this is just a, a little black polo. It's linen and just light and airy. And again, we'll go with slacks that you've packed or some shorts that you packed or a skirt. So, so don't forget your t-shirts, but there again, you can modify them to your taste. I usually pack two to three. So that's really kind of my rule of thumb. And I also have a blog post about this and I'll link that uh, down below and you can go and I actually have packing lists that you can pin that you can, you know, copy and uh, use as a reference. So um, don't forget to do that. But the next item, so I, I have my t-shirts for me, I do two to three and then I pick shirts or blouses. So, and linen is absolutely perfect for summer and a beach vacation. And I love, uh, this is from J. Crew. They have a lot of linen, beautiful linen shirts. This is an Irish linen one and they have a slim fit and they have a regular fit too. So this is a, a pink color. And I, I also throw these over, you know, sometimes just over a swimsuit top and a pair of pants or cutoffs. And, you know, just since I'm at the beach, I can you know, get away with doing things like that. But you can also dress it up and put it with a skirt. So don't forget a linen top. And there again, anthropology comes to my rescue. So this is the cutest top. And I have this on my Instagram stories. I actually traveled in this and uh, very light very airy you can roll the sleeves up you can put it with shorts as i've done and you'll see the the photos because we're we're floating some inspiration photos in but when i put this on my instagram stories i can't tell you how many people are just like beth you have to tell us where this uh, blouse is from so it's anthropology and again everything is linked up down below uh, if I, if it's in stock, then you, you'll have the actual link to that item. If it's not in stock, if it's sold out or if it's old, then I have something similar, but this really cute, just summery blouse from anthropology is perfect. And then there again, um, I, since I pack a lot, I fill my suitcase to the brim. I'm going to go with three blouses. And there again, I picked a beautiful linen blouse. This is a short sleeve blouse. It's just a, uh, a um, over the top and J Crew, so just super easy. And there again, it's white, so neutral goes with everything. So two to three blouses, and then I move on to pants. And I say one to two, but um, of course I'm going to pick two. And I always pick. I call these my party pants. And no matter what season it is, I always have a pair of silk pants. And these are from J Crew. These are from last year, the last time I went to Tybee last summer. So absolutely a dream to put on perfect for, you know, if you're going to a resort, um, vacation and you can, you know, you're going out to dinner, but you still want to be a little bit cool, but still chic. These are absolutely perfect. And you can, you can pair it with, you know, one of the white tees or the black tee, uh, just depending, but a pair of party pants, a pair of silk pants are perfect to take on a beach vacation. And of course, linen. And these are just a dream to wear. These are from Caslon and they are from available at Nordstrom. And I had a, oh gosh, I think it was in April where I had a collab with them. And, um, and then I came along, it was, I was at a resort. And so I had uh, these showcased and, and just a bestseller. So comfortable. I've had so many readers write in and tell me just how great they are. But there again, you can take it with the linen shirt that I just showed you from J crew and pair that there again, you could have even your, your swimming suit on underneath, or you could put your tank top on, on underneath, but it really, really just works out beautifully. So I always go with linen pants and silk pants. So there again, one to two pants, but yep, I like to overpack. So I'm going to go with two pants. And then you don't want to forget shorts because if, when you're on a beach vacation, shorts are just the ticket. And I have a great video that really talks about the over 50 woman wearing shorts because I know many of us have very strong feelings about shorts, but I'm telling you there is a length for you. And I don't think that you should discount shorts because they are just perfect in the hot summer temps. So I'm just, I'm just throwing out there. So I'll link that video up, the video about shorts, and you can watch that. But these are a cute little number from J Crew. So these are embroidered embroidered tennis rackets and they're just very preppy and there again you can you know you can just pop over one of the linen tops you know you can just do the white like that or you can do the polo shirt um, that I that I just showed you so you know so you can mix and match and just you know have a, a cute little outfit 
and you can go to you know a very casual restaurant with ease so a pair of shorts these are embroidered shorts from j crew and then this is actually what i traveled in because i drove to tybee it's about a four hour drive from my home so i had these these are a pair of vents a couple of years old and then i just paired it with the anthropology blouse just you know really perfect to travel in so that was my little travel outfit and i actually wore it to lunch one day too so um, another fun pair of shorts two to three shorts is what i recommend and also, if you have a pair of denim shorts, I love denim shorts, and they really are really great, uh, you know, when you're traveling to a beach vacation, too. So now that we have, like, our basic, you know, casual wear identified and packed, then you want to have a couple of fun outfits, too, because we always want to go to, out to lunch or we want to go to, to dinner. So that's where a dress comes in handy. And I purchased this a few months ago in a t in in anticipation of my beach vacation to Tybee. And this is from Bowden. And again, it's linen, so very lightweight. It's white, we like the little white dress in the summertime, but it has this beautiful embroidery uh, along the neckline and the waistband, and then again, along the hemline. So it just really, just gives you a little oomph. So one fun dress like that. And I always bring this on vacation with me. This is one of the hardest working dresses in my closet. I've had it for about four years. It's still available. It's from Ralph Lauren, my favorite designer. And it has pockets on the side. You can wear it with heels. You can wear it with sneakers. You can wear it with, you know, flats. But anyway, it just is so easy breezy to wear. So this denim dress, it came with me again. Uh, to my vacation and, and this time my beach vacation. It, I mean, as I said, every summer vacation, this, this little number comes along. So one to two, just regular short dresses, but don't forget a maxi dress because maxi dresses are so much fun, especially when you're on vacation. And one of my favorite designers, actually one of my, um, for summer, I love Trina Turk for summer. She has the cutest clothes. Uh, Lily Pulitzer does too and Tori Burt. So those are kind of the, the brands that I go to for, you know, fun summer outfits. So this is just a maxi dress. It's a couple years old from Trina Turk. And it really has a, it has a high low hem. So high, um, or, you know, the higher hem in the front and then the lower hem in the back. And there again, just, you know, really cute. Just add some really jazzy gold jewelry with that. And you are good for an evening out at one of your favorite restaurants when you're on vacation. But if that's a little bit too high priced for you, the scoop line at Walmart, and I've shared this before with you. So they have some really cute dresses too. And I picked up this little number, this little maxi dress. And yes, it does, um, it's sleeveless. So, or not sleeveless, but I mean, it's, um, you know, it just has the bodice and just a very uh, loose fit. But if, if your arms are bothering you, I know that that's really a kind of a problem with some, some ladies, but you can just come along and you know, you just put the, uh, your, your button up over the top and you can tie it at the waist or you can throw a little cardigan over it. You know, so there are options. So don't, you know, completely discount a maxi dress like that. So it's really cute, very fun, flirty, and oh, so affordable, okay? So don't forget maxi dresses. And then, of course, sleepwear. Hello, no brainer. Um, I just wanted to share this with you. So this is a company, I've, dis I've discovered them in the past maybe year or so. It's called The White Company. And it's a British company. And I absolutely love their sleepwear. So if you want to feel, you know, like you're wearing butter when you're sleeping, um, go with The White Company. And this is just a really cute little, little uh, number here. Uh, Target actually had some really cute pajamas too when I was in last. So there again, that's more of a high end, Target's more of a low end, but don't forget your PJs. And then we're gonna go into swimwear because of course that's why we're going to the beach is to do some swimming. So I just, again, I recently had a collaboration with Nordstrom. So I had this one shoulder, it's, a, it's from La Blanca is the name of the brand and it's available at Nordstrom. I'll have the links down below. Uh, one shoulder and then it has beautiful ruching and it had some tummy control too. So I really, really liked it. Just very simple. It's black. It also comes in indigo. And then we need a cover up. 
And one easy way uh, to cover up your swimming suit, and uh, for sure if you're at a resort, you need to have a cover up because you can't go through the lobby with just your swimming suit on. So an easy way is just an oversized linen blouse. And I have worn, you know, cover ups like this. Okay. Or the other one is, and I, um, and I got this for my beach vacation. So this is a cute little hoodie. You could, it could double as a, a tunic. So it's just a little hoodie. It's, it's a stripe. It's La Blanca. Again, the swimwear company, like the, the black one shoulder. So that's just perfect. Um, you know, to pop over your swimming suit. Plus you could, um, as I said, you can double it as a tunic as well. And yes, I showed you a one piece suit, but ladies, I know I'm 62 years old, but yes, I still wear a two piece to the suit and I'm going to float some photos in. It's still very tasteful. If you feel comfortable doing that, I recommend wearing a two piece or a tankini, a one piece, because you don't need a beach bod to go to the beach. You just need a cute suit and some attitude, but we don't want to forget sun protection. So a hat, you have to have a hat when it comes to the beach. And this is one, this is a, a favorite brand of my mother. It's called Eric Javits. And it has a, a patented technology. So you can actually pack this and not have to worry, you know, because it has a, uh, as I said, patented uh, fabric. And so you can crush it and mush it and you can just throw it into anything and it'll just take the beating. So, but if you just have a regular hat, I have a packing video and I'm going to share that with you too on how to pack a hat when you're going on vacation. So, um, this is a little bit pricey. I will share that with you because it, it does have the, the special fabric, but it's, it's worth every penny. And then of course you need a cute little beach bag. So um, this is just adorable and this can actually, it's big enough to carry a few things to the beach. Not a, you know, it's not a huge beach bag. I also have another video that talks about what to put in your beach bag and I'll link that uh, below or up above too. Okay. And then last but not least, we're going to talk about shoes because we have to have shoes. So flip flops are always important. Okay. And these are jelly flip flops. And I just, I actually, these are quite old, but I added another one uh, this year into my repertoire. And I, why I love jelly flip flops is because you can wear them on the sand. They can take a beating and then you can just wash them off when you're washing your feet off when you come back. Um, you know, to your hotel room or the house that, that uh, you, you perhaps rented at the beach. And then sneakers. And I usually just get white sneakers because they go with everything. So these happen to be Stan Smith's, one of my favorite brands. So sneakers. And then I also like wedge espadrilles too, because these will go with your maxi dress. These can go with your shorts. These can go with just so many things. So there you have it. Don't forget, I've linked down below. You can head to my blog. You can actually get those packing lists. It's just all beautifully made up and uh, you will be set to go on that beach vacation. I am telling you, a beach vacation is my all-time favorite vacation because you just get to be a beach bum and honestly feel as if you've had a vacation when you get back home. Give me a thumbs up if you like the video. Don't forget to leave a comment down below and I'll see you again very, very soon. Bye-bye.